generation away from extinction. We didn't pass it to our children in the bloodstream. It must be fought for, protected and handed on to do the same. Good evening to one and all present over here. Esteemed Panda sir, respected jury members and my dear friends. Today I, Nishita, present here to speak a few lines on the great occasion of Independence Day. Today our India is celebrating its 76th year of independence from the British rule. The Independence Day of India shows not only Independence Day of India shows not only the independence of India from the rule of British but also its power. India has progressed a lot since 1947 and is on its way on becoming a superpower. India is celebrating this Independence Day with its newly elected president Shrimati Draupadi Murmu who took over as the 15th president of Indian Republic. She is not only the first Dalit woman to become the first citizen of our country but also the first president to be born in independent India. She became also the first woman from scheduled tribe to serve as the president of India. Like many other nations, India also suffered great injustice and tyranny under foreign rule. But what distinguishes India from others is the characters played by our nationalists like Mahatma Gandhi who based on the principle of truth and non-violence. After many years of struggle, India got independence. India is an independent nation now. Uh, as our the preamble of Indian constitution declared itself as sovereign, secular and democratic and as the citizens and youth of our country it is our responsibility to uphold those pillars of virtue. On Independence Day, the uh, on Independence Day Thank you.